Today, for this event, we are officializing the partnership between the Brand Environment Management Authority, REMA, and Academia. Policies are made as responses to challenges that governments and the agencies are trying to find a way of handling and controlling. So what research does is to help improve the quality of action, to improve our understanding of these challenges, the complexity, so we can better target, we can better measure, we can better track what we do, and therefore ensure that we have better outcomes in terms of resolving the problems that we are facing. Comprehensive African Climate Change Initiative, the initial uh, idea was just to support the African countries to implement their, their nationally determined contributions and national adaptation plans. This initiative has been uh, uh, undertaken by different organizations and supported by USAID. And also in Africa, we are facilitated two African institutions, Academia 263 and RINAPRI. We also intend to measure some other biogeophysical parameters, uh, not just the emissions. Uh, we're also going to track the land use, land cover changes, and also uh, some other biogeophysical parameters, uh, such as vegetation indices, uh, the rainfall, land surface temperature, day and night, and also the evapotranspiration patterns. We brought together different methods because one method cannot address all the questions that we have to address under this uh, the climate change adaptation and mitigation issues in order to cover as much as we can under this project. The government of Rwanda ensured that climate concerns are mainstreamed in the national development agenda, uh, including the Vision 2050. And this portrays uh, the will of the government to put environment and climate change are the center of all the development agenda we have.